Hello YouTube, this one's Chris again. I just want to state before we jump into this manga. Uh, so, I use pictures of the manga within the thumbnail just to show what we talk about. Uh, <laughs> I do live reactions to the manga. I will describe out the manga and you get my reaction to each panel my thoughts and ideas for future chapters or what I think might happen within these manga reactions slash reviews but you will not be seeing it on the video so if you guys were hoping to see manga the manga on the site I might once in a while when I have my phone look at the manga I might show it to the screen but that's pretty much it otherwise that might change in the future but for right now that's how we're doing manga so otherwise, hope you guys enjoy the video and let's jump into it. Hello YouTube. This is Mr. Krizik. I'm back. Let me just check one thing before we jump into this fairy tale manga chapter. Okay. Just want to make sure something recorded correctly. Um, this fairy tale 100 year quest, chapter 65. L. L. Ellen here. It has to be the moon guy dragon. People are saying I should get to this because apparently it has a decent part of it. Okay, the white witch is woken. You can't use your magic. What the hell are you up to? Don't even think about it. He lowers her hand. You see the fairy tale crest is still on her. Please excuse me. Can you please give me some water? Water. Toka. I have to wake up. Wait, which? We're out of time. Time for El Elantir is Elantir. It can't be. It can't be. I mean, you're also an Antiro's. It's no longer possible for me to save Elantir. Why are they they talking about? Who knows? If Natsu-san and the others overcame Alderaan, please, Toka, must send them to Altair. And what were you using my body for? It's all so I could save El Elantir. I beg of you, Toka. Elantir is saved. Or accept whatever punishment you may give me. She's kneeling. What is she doing? What's Ellen's here? I don't know. We haven't even told Natsu and the Natsu Sama, the others. It was only for a short time, but I was one with you. I should be able to use your magic. She's gonna try to use the magic. So the magic we saw was off the X seeds, not. Off the white witch. Aqua, aura, you mustn't use that. I apologize for everything until now, Toka. The time I spent with you wasn't all bad. Hey, you can't just use magic like. Don't do it. And you can see, I'm guessing she teleported because she's making a ring, and then the next panel is just she's gone. What? She vanished. Magic is not simple to use. This is bad. Water, please give me some water. And then we're over to a bathhouse, I'm guessing. Could we hurry up and buy new clothing, please? Oh, I don't want to buy girls' clothes. It'd be bad if you let a guy with Natsu taste go do this shopping. As long as we get back to the inn, I don't care. So why don't we just use your spirit's clothes? Of course. How could I forget? Maid. She probably wants attention. Hmm? So I'm guessing that's um, Virgo's uh, clothing set. She's glowing. Oh, they're all glowing. Lucy, your body lay up. Yours too. And mine. And they're, they're gone. What is this? Urza? Urza is glowing. Gray Summer, your body is okay, gray. Also, Wendy, Charla. Charla, what's happening? Our bodies are lighting up. 
and they all disappear. Oh, apparently, Wendy and Carla were in the guild hall, or somewhere, I'm guessing the guild hall, or somewhere near, at least near Luzana, Elfman, and Mary Jane. Oh my. Shouldn't you be worried, sis? Where are we? Natsu, Urza, Grey Summer. I need two? Ja. That's Lucy's voice. What's wrong? My clothing. They totally disappeared. Urza is blushing, but Grey's blushing hard. <laughs> Natsu, let me see. Please don't. How did this happen? Wait, where are we? Where are we even? We should have been in Jamil, but where were we transported somewhere else? What gives? I can't use my celestial magic. Anyways, here, put this on. And Gray gave Lucy his cloak. No, hold on a second. I can't use magic either. Neither can I. Me neither. How did this happen? So where have they been teleported? Mama? Lucy's shocked. Everyone's shocked. Are you mama right? Huh? Huh? Didn't Lucy have a child? Say what? It can't be. Lucy laid an egg? Mama? Oh, I think she just mistaken her for someone else. Nasha, I told you. I thought I said don't go too far. Are we in Atlas? Is that where we are? I think we're in Atlas. Oh, it's been a long time. I actually need to... The funny part is I skipped portions of Atlas. I've seen portions of it, the end portion, somewhere in the middle, and then the beginning. So I'm missing. So I have to go back to uh, Fairy Tale and actually watch it. Atlas was one of the ones I skipped through. But I've seen every other episode. So I actually have to finish Atlas. Which is funny that Atlas is now in here. Huh? I see surprised. Everybody's surprised. She's... Huh? How? It can't be. You're Earth Lucy. Hello, hello Lucy? Don't tell me we're in Hellas. Hellas, a parallel world separated from Earthland. Where Natsu and the others live, magic power doesn't exist here, so magic can't be used. It's been a while. How are you holding up? Uh, fine, I guess. Why, why are we in Hellas? How do we get here? No, not to. Gray. Tiny Wendy. Still as shrimpy as ever. Hold up. How do you still look so young? Well, it's been nine years. Tell, tell me time flows differently for you. Oh, uh, well. My bad. I should have introduced you first. This is my kid, Nasha. Hey, Lucy had a kid? Why are you turning red? <laughs> Lucy's the one turning red. Come on. Did I tell you before Mama and her friends were saved by other worlds, Mama? And her friends of the world. Anyhow, uh, what are you doing here? Well, uh, fairy tale guild, Atlas, with the truck outside. It's good to see you again. Oh, fucking. Good to see you again, me. Hey, Fireball. Uh, please stop with that. Well, I'm Papa now. So, yeah, Natsu and Lucy and Atlas had a kid. He's still unreliable, though. Hello, Lucy, and hello, Natsu got married? So did Ju uh, Gray and Juvia. It's been a while. Come on, say hello to them, Grieg. Hello. Mm, why are you turning red? Gray's, Gray's turning red. I think Gray actually does have a lot of feelings for Juvia at this point. So it's him thinking about having a kid with her probably sent him over the point there. Man, this takes me back. The uh, Jet and Droid. They definitely, oh, these versions, Elfman. Come think of it. We never heard about the other us. They're still the strongest. I just received some bl delicious black tea. Oh, yeah, kind of as a tea drinker here, not an alcoholic. The tea kind of sound makes this excellent. Is Lasagna doing well? Yeah. Gasp. It's Wendy. Wendy and Alice has 
is tall and has big chest. Remember last time you were here? Oh, Atlas lost its magic. Now we're working as a courier guild. That's when I say courier, I mean we use carriages since we don't have any cars anymore. That reminds me, they're using steam in the royal capital. They're developing cars as we speak. Really? Can't wait to get one. I'm one. No way. When you're in a car, you get a bit uh, extreme. Now you're turning red, Lucy. Did we ever meet uh, a Laxus from this side? No, because if... No, because Nazi wouldn't make sense. If I went off the statement of them being 400 years old, then uh, Atlas Nazi wouldn't make sense here. I mean, this guy Gio is somewhere. <clears throat> Everyone, you haven't changed one bit. Hello? We have kids? Gray and Lucy are the most red. <clears throat> so how did you get here? What are you here for? Or you don't know. That's right. Maybe Prince Miss in the capital could do something about it. But first, Urza. Our Urza Nightwalker is in the castle. Whatever you... In the capital. Whatever you do, do don't meet her. You'll regret it. I wonder how much the Urza here has changed. No. This isn't... This isn't... Out tears. Where am I? Even though I also transfer, transferred... Natsu Sam and the others... With Akira Aura. I must have gotten lost. But besides that, I can't use magic. I have no way to return to the original world. Yeah. I kind of figured if no one can use... I don't know how they're getting off of this. So it looks like we might be in an Atlas for a while, which I'm perfectly fine for, fine with. Fuck. Apparently people are asking where the One Piece chapter is this week. Okay. Very curious on where they're going to go with Atlas because they could really show off a lot. Atlas, the final couple pages there would miss again. The final couple episodes would miss again, and their send off was probably. Probably one of my favorite sends off, uh, send off in the, in the series. But it's Atlas, like I said, Atlas ended and it was my favorite. But for chapter 65, which, what was this called again? End tier. Valentier. I wonder where this is going to take us because more than likely he has a point of us being in the editor list not just to see how much time has passed them but also something else entirely to its entirety
Oh. Oh. Uh, I went in a tan in bed for uh, 10 minutes. My family has one now. They bought it when a tan place was remodeling. So they got really cheap. It's all cleaned up and all that. And then I just need to get a darker shade. Um, at least for my legs, because I wear shorts a lot. Okay, but really, Atlas is probably one of the, like I said, one of my favorite, well, one of my favorite side arcs, if it is a side, no, it's not a side arc, it's actually written in the story, which is insane to see because Atlas was such a, a, a like a fastball, because I was like, is this, is this actually written? But it is. They did breaks in between, so there wasn't going to be a lot of filler, if there's any filler at all. So, I wonder if I can find Missigan's set off. I did find it. See Myth Miss Mistogen again would be incredible, but I think more than likely Mistogen is with Urza in this world. Would be my guess. This is not even the send off. I looked up the send off, it was just one of the quotes. It's one of my favorite send off because it also gives you the three rules of fairy tale. And if you guys didn't know the rules, bye. Oh, oh my neck. The three rules of believe a fairy tale. One, you must never reveal sensitive information about fairy tale. Talk to others for as long as you live. Two, you must never use formal contacts met through. You're being in the guild for personal gain. Three, though your our paths may have diverged, you must continue to live out your life with all your might. You never, you must never consider your li own life to be something insignificant. Okay. And you must never forget about your friends who loved you. Ugh. Yeah, but for chapter 65, it, I'm giving it, um, 8 out of 10. 9 out of 10, because we're analysts. If we weren't in analysts, I'd give it 8 out of 10. But if we're in analysts, I don't know where we're going. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like the video, like it. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, I recommend subscribing to the channel to keep up with all content. Otherwise, this has been Miss Crazy again. Sign off. Have a good morning. Have a good afternoon. Have a good night. Wherever you are, just have a good day. Hope I see you guys next video, and peace.